It's exactly 8.30 here on the AM show. Now, Busy, a leading 4G internet service provider, last week launched an online portal called Jump. Now, this portal contains exciting content aimed at inspiring and empowering Ghanaian youth. So, what is Jump? All the questions you have on Jump is going to be addressed now. Joyce Danso is a youth program manager uh, at Busy, and Daryl Kwao is with us here. <laughs> at multimedia Hi, so, good morning to you good morning. morning it will be good to start with you uh, mm -hmm. joyce jump what are we jumping <laughs> over okay so jump like the name suggests is basically an e-learning portal for young people but this time we want young people to jump for their dreams their aspirations their mm. goals jump and let the best out of you be seen by the world okay but this time is on a digitalized platform and that's what jump is offering so this platform provides content on education, lifestyle, entrepreneurship, self-improvement and motivation to inspire young people, to give them the aspirations and the belief that indeed whatever dreams they have can come into life if they're able to get the right content that mm. will help them to be able to develop themselves. Oh, okay. All right. So this portal is active now? Yes, it is. It is active. If I log on, what will be the address to log on in? If I do, what are my options? Okay, so you log on using www.jam.com.gh, www.jam.com.gh, and mm -hmm. you would have access to the home page that gives you a variety of articles from education, entrepreneurship, lifestyle, and self-entertainment, um, self-improvement, and inspiration. Okay. So you have access to all these articles. You see the new ones, you see the trending ones, and you see the recommended ones for you as well. Then in, on the page, you can actually access the articles on the education page as well entrepreneurship, lifestyle, and then self-improvement page. So you have access to all these articles mm. written by very good writers and, I mean, editors as well who have actually provided content for this. I guess that's why Daryl is here. That's where he can That's why Daryl is Okay, so Daryl, okay. what, what would you be writing so on? So I'm going to be the editor of the entrepreneurship category. Okay. So you're basically looking at uh, young people who are coming out of schools uh, with dreams of dream business. How do we build capacity, how do we empower them, how do we give them the necessary tools. So it's going to be like a master class. How do you manage your finance? How do you network? How to use the internet to boost your business? Mm. And also we'll be sharing stories of entrepreneurs who have succeeded, especially the young ones, so they can be a motivation to other young people who are graduating from school who, who want to learn about some of these things. So many times we've had conversation here about, you know, youth unemployment yeah. and you know, people coming out of school not having their requisite skills. And I believe that this is the perfect opportunity for them to learn. Of course, there are other categories, um, lifestyle. Talking about lifestyle and entertainment. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. Youth are fun people. They like to have yeah. fun. So there's something in there for you as well. And as well as uh, self-improvement, because yeah. that's, th that's one thing that is lacking among the youth mm. when they graduate from school. They don't, they don't know how to groom themselves, you know, to be marketable when they come out of school. So, so I if I have a, a small business, uh, how is it going to help me exactly? Is it that you're updating me on the new things that I have to do? Yes, uh, trends, latest trends, you know, things are changing around us and people have to be abreast of what is changing around us. And like I said, a master class. So information you're not getting in school, for mm. instance, how to manage your business, how to start your business, <laughs> where to go to. I, I mean, most schools don't teach that in their curriculum. So this is, like I said, a perfect opportunity for them to learn something out of school. Okay, and which means you are also part. updated every minute. Exactly. Yes, mm -hmm. I have to be yeah. updated uh -huh. every minute. And yeah. that's, that's a challenge too as well. <laughs> okay, so uh, Busy could have done a lot of things. Why jump? Okay, now Busy is currently or has always had the heart of young people. It, it has always been in the interest of BZ to ensure that we empower young people, provide them with a platform where they can be able to develop and grow. We know that every country's development solely lies on young people and with their improvement, we are secured of a very good future. That's why BZ is, has come up with this whole idea of JUMP because mm. we understand that students face or young people face quite a number of challenges in the various fields they find themselves in, whether in school or our workplace. And, they should be able to find themselves, they should be able to develop, they should be able to have this content that is going to help them to build themselves. When they face the job market or when they are in school, they'll be able to overcome these challenges. Mm. And that is why BZ has actually moved into this whole idea of providing a platform to solve issues of young people. Mm. So we have come up with selecting, or we have selected four editors 
who connect with young people. Okay. Editors who we believe that can inspire young people. And that's why you see Daryl here. You see me Representing here. entrepreneurship. Uh -huh. Exactly. You have, what are you Education. representing? Education. And okay. then we have Jessica Corney, who is a fashion blogger, one of the well-known fashion bloggers, representing lifestyle and entertainment. Okay. And Bernard Calvin Clive, representing self-improvement and inspiration. Now, we chose these editors because we believe that they connect with young people and they, they are people that young people can actually look up to and get inspired. And you provide a content together with the writers to ensure that we have content all the time to support the cause of what young people would want to actually achieve in the and, future. And when we think about this, um, 60 to 70 percent of the country's population is below 25 years. Mm. How are we empowering them? And that's why I think that this uh, great idea by BZ to empower young people in the country. It's fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if, if, if I'm looking for a school that can give me some scholarship, uh, is that information that I expect that From Joyce category, would, yeah, yes, would give me? We give that and even more. Now, what we look at or what I look at when it comes to education is not just to focus on the normal classroom education that people have. Now, real issues that students face that have not been tackled, issues of research that students are facing quite on campus, issues or you know, there are many things that students go through on campus that people haven't mentioned because mm -hmm. we feel it's normal. First year is going to school, what are the challenges they're likely to face? I mean, reading a program that you know, that you feel within you that this program is not going to help, but then, you know, now it's not the case. So just to inspire and get people mm -hmm. motivated that, hey, you can do this program but still do something better. So education is basically not looking at the normal boring thing that we all have in mind, <laughs> just going to read literature probably, yeah. you know? It gives you a, a, a broader perspective about life. We are now even running something called Student Without Borders uh, on education platform where we look at students who are doing something extraordinary even mm. though they are on campus. They are not allowing their programs to serve as limitations. So they are playing chess, winning awards and laurels and various fields that they find themselves in. So the education category basically centers on all areas. So if you want a scholarship, mm. if it's something that obviously force within that category, which does, you find that also and in the platform. How do you get that scholarship? Yeah. How, how do you, you put yourself that? in a yeah. position? And how do you even write <laughs> these essays, which many people don't have the idea, the statement of purpose and all that. Sometimes it's quite challenging. Yeah. We provide you that information on Jump. And nice. Harvey, what we shouldn't lose sight of is the power of the internet. And that's what BZ is using, because so many young people go to the internet. For so you need many data reasons. to do this. <laughs> yes. Of course, I don't know if they have the It's zero rated yes. to some extent. Yeah. Uh, really? Yeah, to some extent. Oh, OK. So are there, you know, special packages that come with the data as well uh, to own, uh, you know, whatever it is that I, c I can use to have access to the internet? Okay, let me <laughs> start by this. So mm. we, with this whole launch of Jump, there's a very good package for students out there that you can be able to buy a MyFi at a very reduced price, 99, okay. with 5GB, 4G for life. And whenever you top up, it comes with 2GB data for free. So you can always have access okay. to our platform. And like I said, it's, it's something that one thing is that we are taking education, or we are taking the platform off you going for a seminar in order for you to just have access to content. When mm. you are working, you can have your phone and have access yeah. to content. And that is what we want. And it's paperless to too. Exactly. So you don't need to say, I don't, <laughs> you don't have an excuse. The only yeah. excuse you have is that you have several options. And even that isn't a good excuse. Okay, so <laughs> two questions from me. Is there an interactive, you know, can I interact with my editor at some point in time? Always. So when you read these articles, you can actually comment. And when you comment, your editor comes back to reply you. Okay. And it, there's that connection. Okay. So whenever you have events as well on campuses, the editors are around to engage students. So these are editors we believe can connect with students. So you know, Daryl, <laughs> everyone obviously would want to connect with our own entrepreneurship category. Mm. So when you read an article and you have a question, you can always put in your comments on why this, that, that. And if you have any problem that you feel you want Daryl's consent, you want Daryl's help in that, he'll also come on board to help you. And nice. And of yeah. course, Jump is partnering with uh, so many universities across the country to be able to interact with these students. So we are not just on the platform, but also on ground to interact with students, yeah. Okay, as facilitators sometimes. <laughs> so my other question is, would you need more contributors? Definitely. For every field, you would need more contributors and mm. I mean, to ensure that it's sustainable. And we would obviously be happy to partner with more universities, partner with more organizations to ensure that we 
put out the message of jump out there, busy. And I must add that we are, busy is actually, this is a ping-pong program. Um, it's integrated. We have the busy brand ambassadors, student brand ambassadors. We have our graduate training program and the online portal, which is jump. So oh. this is an approach that busy is taking to support the cause of young people. And on Friday, we launched this officially at Kempiski with the Deputy Minister of Education there to support. Mm. So what's been the response? I, it's very early, yes. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, what's been the feedback? I was very excited when I visited the portal and realized we had already started reading the articles. Okay. And they were commenting and they were very happy about it. So she told you that students are happy, young people are happy. They have been waiting for this. And it looks like busy came in at the right time to satisfy them and provide them the answers that they needed. So yeah. they're all very happy. And the response is positive. We hope to have more young people get engaged on this platform. So if you're home and you're watching us, if you're listening, wherever you find yourself, mm -hmm. just visit www.jump.com.gh. And jump is the J-U-M-P. Jump, yes. Just jump. jump. Yes. Just jump. Okay, so just jump on it right now. <laughs> just start typing. Media, yes, we're also nice on social media. Uh, okay. That's on Facebook, so jump underscore Ghana. Right? And then busy Ghana. Busy yes. Ghana, sorry. Jump underscore busy Ghana mm. and also on Twitter and Instagram. Yeah. yeah. So on okay. Instagram jump Ghana and on Twitter at Ghana Jump. Okay. Yeah. So Daryl, what what articles do you have already running on the page? Okay, so how how do you start your business? Um, we also have something on partnerships because okay. uh, that's one of the challenge when you, yeah. you, you want to start a business and you want to partner with somebody. Sometimes they don't work. How do you make it work? Also, working from home. Most people start their business working from home. So what are the advantages? I mean, these are some of the articles you'd find if you, if you uh, log on to the website. Nice. Right now. And you don't have to pay anything. You're not paying to access no. all this no, information. That's your media, I think. Yeah, <laughs> yeah nice. you're not paying anything. Is there, is, are you running this for maybe like a three-month period, six months? It's or? jump for life. Wow. <laughs> I like it even more. It's for Jump life. for Life. So okay. you, any day, any time, you can come on Jump and you have access to information. Okay. You need. One recommendation, mm. if, that's, if you mm. are open to it, is an editor for maybe reproductive health, health, uh, health or something like that because you have a lot of relationship issues. You have a lot of... <laughs> that's interesting. <laughs> a lot of, yeah. So just so, okay, you know, well, that's I guess another area that I think... You'll be available for that, for that. Yeah. She's no, got thank lots you. Of experience. Okay, guys. Unless there's any sure. other thing that you want to add uh, that you haven't said to us yet, okay, otherwise so it's a wrap. It's time for young people to jump. So visit the platform, get more information, and always be willing to learn from mm. the platform. Comments. Let us know what you feel. Let us know your views. We are, there's a story carrying on education category on national service. Okay. Share that experience with us. Let us know that it's not all the time that having national service in the village is bad. Like people assume it mm. is. And let's encourage other people to do that when their time comes as well. So just visit okay. comments and share with friends. It's time to jump on any other category as well, not just on education. All right. Fantastic. Yeah. Daryl? And we'll be hoping to have you on board as a reproductive. <laughs> That was really? <laughs> That's a joke. It's, it's good to, to see that even the van, the business van, is taking another form. Yeah. You can have access to the producer of the van on, on Jump, and which is really cool. Which support. is really cool. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thank you, Joyce. Thank yeah. you, Daryl, uh, for telling us about Jump. And I hope that a lot more of you will get onto Jump right now. Uh, because this is what we need. Sometimes you you really want to speak to someone, but there's nobody. And I think this is, you know, like the easiest way out uh, with this new concept from Busy. Stay with us. We still have a lot more for you before 9 a.m.